I've got the list down here. I, I wrote it down. Do you want to? Do you want to go through the list that Steve Rogers has and talk about anything on there? You have the list. Go ahead, read it out to me. I'm sorry. Yeah. All right. So stop me as I go through this. If there's something that that um catches your your eye and and you want to talk about. All right. So first okay. on the list is I Love Lucy television. Uh, great show. Yeah. Great show. Um. Really funny. Next up is the Lucille Ball is hilarious. Yeah. Next up is uh, the moon landing, which just really kind of a true a true fact, a true fact, a true thing. And really happened. illustrates how much uh, Steve Rogers is missed because that's old for yeah. That's Steve really Rogers old for probably us. yeah. Steve Rogers probably heard about the moon landing and was like, no way. Yeah, that's mind really? blowing for what? him. It's still mind blowing for me too. <laughs> be honest, it's well, mind blowing. Hey, we don't hey, go back. We should go to the moon every weekend. All those, uh, all those people that believe it's fake. Yeah, we we have an education problem in this country. Right. All right. He uh, he has a note about the Berlin Wall. Uh, not only mm-hmm. it coming down, but also it going up. <laughs> so hmm. his note his note is <laughs> Berlin funny. Wall up and down. Up up and down. <laughs> That's good. That's funny. Yeah. Do you remember that? Do you remember that? That day, I remember it coming down. Yeah, me too. Like I was at home watching TV, and it started happening. No, I wa- and then all- no, I was watching TV, and they showed East Berliners being allowed to go to West Berlin, and I was like, "That's weird." And then they started showing the wall going. I watched it all day. And my mom was like, "What are you watching?" I was like, "I'm oh, watching wow. the Berlin Wall go down, Mom. It's it's the big historical event." And she's like, just rolled her eyes and walked off. <laughs> like I was a kid, but but I, right. but I realized this was a, a once in a moment event that I, that that was a really important. I, that's that day will always be kind of like a big day for me. I don't yeah. know why. It's just one of those weird memories. Well, anyway, that's, continue. That's please. good. I I don't have that uh, deep of a memory about it. I just remember you know it happening. Um, right. Keep going. All right. Uh, Steve Jobs, Apple. That's a good. Mm-hmm. That's a good note to have. I think. I know you like that. Yeah. Um. Disco, also a great mm. note. Steve, Steve needs to know about disco. Yeah. Um, Thai food. My son was really excited to see Thai food on Steve's list of things to do. It, does your son like Thai food? Uh, yeah, he really likes um, Pod CU. That's Yeah, me too. I mean, whenever I get Thai food, I just get Pad Thai, which pad is thai. like the lamest thing you can get. <laughs> yeah, I think... Uh, I think Pad CU is uh, on its way of overtaking Pad Thai as the default. Yeah, those uh, fat noodles, right? Thai. Those fat yeah. noodles are good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, Star Wars. He's got that crossed out. I assume that means he's watched. He's watched them. Yeah. yeah. Uh, he also has Star Trek, but he hasn't done anything with that yet. Nirvana. Band next to it. Hmm. That's a good note. Yeah. That's, I didn't know that. That's, that's, a, that's one of my favorite bands. Yeah, that's a, that's a, great, that's note. a great note. Um. I'm a huge Nirvana fan, although I wasn't really at the time. I became a fan after um, Kurt Cobain's death, really. Hmm. I was I, I um I was a fan. I was a heavy fan. I mean, and I, I was in high school when he died. Yeah, they had their like, they had their songs that I really liked, um, but I wasn't yeah. a big fan at the time. Uh, Rocky, and then Rocky Two, great and, movie and, uh, with a question mark next to it. Great movie. Yeah. And, and then Trouble Man, the soundtrack. That's a good list. Man, that list is great. <laughs> uh, this is fantastic. Maybe we should, uh, like maybe we should it, do Steve Rogers' list sometime. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like a whole day of it, you know? Uh, that kind of just highlights um, his character. And, and, like, Steve Rogers' character is just so... It's not, it's not pure altruism, but it just seems like he just seems like a nice guy. You know, like you would want to hang out with him and do things with him. Right. 